वेलकम टू त्रेगोमा अकेडमी थैंक यू सो मच फॉर योर लव फॉर माई प्रीवियस वीडियोज टूडे वी विल डिस्कस द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट थिंग बिकॉज सम ऑफ माई यूजर्स सम ऑफ माई व्यूअर्स आर रिक्वेस्टिंग मी टू क्रिएट अ वीडियो ऑन हाउ कैन वी इंस्टॉल द प्लग इन इन पर्सनल डेवलपमेंट इंस्टेंस एंड वॉट इज द प्रोसीजर टू इंस्टॉल द प्लग इन फॉर एनी ऑर्गेनाइजेशन दिस इज द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट थिंग how can we go ahead with the plugin how can we install that particular application in service now instance so guys if you still not subscribe my channel please subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon and share with your colleagues so that that video will be very helpful in this video we will understand how can we install the plugin what is the procedure what are the steps to we install that plugin and what are uh, you know how the personal development instance instance uh, plugin installation is different from the any organization development instance or the real time implementation or real time in, in plugin installation so let's start okay this is my personal development instance okay so uh, if you want to uh, uh, create a personal development instance if you want to access of the personal development instance you just need to go to the uh, service now developer side and register yourself and service now will provide you the uh, personal development instance for learning purpose that instance will be free of cost so you can uh, install i mean uh, you can access that instance and you can install the plugin as per your requirement for the learning purpose this is totally free of cost okay and uh, that instance will, gi will give you the practical uh, knowledge practical knowledge of the service now and you can hands on or better hands on on this platform okay so as a developer you just go to the service now developer side or uh, just register yourself and get the access of the personal development instance and enjoy the implementation and the configuration learning of the service now so this is my personal development instance now we will learn how can we install the plugin i will show you how can we install the plugin so in the navigator bar we will search as a plugin okay under the system definition there are two options visible first is a plugin and the plugin history if you will go to the plugin history the all plugins which are installed in your application and which date the upgrade was finished upgrade was static each and everything will be captured here so you can see history type is plugin and the type is application so which uh, plugins till now i have activated in my personal development so this is the number of plugins so like i have integrate i have installed the risk plugin grc workspace advanced grc so all of these listed plugins i have already insta uh, installed on my personal development instance if you not watch my previous video I, in in my previous videos i have uh, shared the knowledge in grc like risk management advanced uh, audit management ad advanced risk management vendor management so to enable those application i have installed these plugins okay so this is the list this is just for the reference purpose but the intention and the aim of this video is to create uh, how to install the plugins so let me come again open the click on the plugin section under the system definition while we click on the plugins the list of uh, plugins uh, like a uh, similar like a google play store like we have a store we have also a service now store what we are doing is uh, suppose that if you want to install any application in our android system what we are doing we go to the google uh, play store just write the name and install the plugin similar like uh, uh, install the application similar in service now we have a store okay we have a, a plugin application i mean the plugin platform where we just go click on the app plugins and in uh, write the name of that uh, application and all uh, related plugins will be listed uh, and search accordingly and you can install those plugin according to the requirement okay guys it is taking little bit time because this is heavy application and one more thing i would like to add here this uh, system uh, plugins is available only for the admin users right not for any other user so only the person who has a admin role is capable to install the plugin okay nobody else can install the plugin in instance except the admin okay so uh, as you can see uh, we have opened the uh plugins so see in the filter bar there is a all applications see, you can see the all applications are listed here 1946 results are here 
and if you want to store in uh, uh, find in store if something is not listed here you can request a plugin via this ui action okay in the left left side navigator bar you can see there is a filter option available like you need applications or a service now product okay obtain installed not installed update customize or installation schedule installed it means you already installed those plugins so you don't want to uh, see in a result or so you can apply as a filter i don't need an installed one okay you 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 are just wanted to see how uh, which plugins we are which are not installed yet so we can check as a not installed update similar like a customize if we need a customize plugin or a installation schedule we can schedule the installation in the service now two types of plugins are available some plugins are free of cost available so anyone can use but some plugins are the pay one okay so in the personal development instance don't worry you no need to pay anything if you are installing the paid plugin this is because this platform is just for the learning purpose but if you are working on any organization instance then there are some plugin which is paid and you want to install that plugin in your organization then definitely you need to pay for that plugin then uh, you can install that plugin there is a different procedure in that case you there is a high portal access uh, when service now is uh, giving you the instance access for any organization they providing the high portal access as well so the all plugins and all upgrades done through and cloning will be done through that high portal so the the who is the super admin or who the person who has a so uh, i mean uh, the uh, high portal access uh, go to the high portal and raise the request for that and need to pay complete the payment after that it will be applicable to uh, th that instance but in personal development instance we don't need uh, to pay anything for the paid uh, plugins okay there are some plugins which require the licensing structure like uh, some plugins are required the subscription but sub uh, uh, like sub plugins are not required the subscription and there are few plugins which are you know subscription unknown okay we can set as a product family which product family you are looking for like a governance risk and compliance customer risk now intelligence okay so different different product families are available here so i hope this is clear to you now we are coming to the result see activity formatter this is a pre default install see this is install button is disabled it means this plugin is already installed in our personal development in my personal development instance okay activity stream this is already installed now see act action status automation this required the installation so see this install button is enabled if i want to install that plugin i just need to click install then uh, there are few steps which i need to do but in this video i, I am going to install a one plugin related to the hr case management okay because i am uh, again trying to do some uh, 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 trying to cover in some videos in HR domain, so uh, I will uh, uh, try to install that HR plugins. Okay, so I just put it the HR SD. So you can see there is a one application case and knowledge management HR case and knowledge management. Okay, you can see the advanced work assignment HR SD CTI predictive intelligence. So there are install and update all plugins now you can see hr service delivery advanced integration with oracle this is plugin is not installed yet hr service delivery advanced integration with workday is not installed yet mobile agent is not installed so there are few plugins let me do one thing i need to install i will show you human yes so guys uh, today uh, i will um data migration there are few plugins what i need to do I will go to that application case and knowledge. I will click the install. Along with this, these plugins, these are the uh, these application below will be installed in our application. It means if we will install this plugin, these uh, applications will be installed in our service now instance. I mean human resource core workspace, human resource core application, demo data for HR as the human resource scopes so these application will be installed if we install the employee document management then performance analytics and employee document management two applications will be installed if we install the employee relation then evidence management interview templates and human uh, resource scope application will be installed enterprise onboarding and uh, transition if we install this one then human resource lifecycle event for enterprises and and the performance analytics will be installed so what i need to do i will just uh, install the basic 
plugin let me search first i need to check i installed or not i if i remembered and i think uh, not i didn't install yet that is a good news for us so see now i will uh, in going to install this plugin i will show you one another example see currently if we are uh, we are checking through the score there is no human application i mean the human hr service levy no application is available see you can see i search through the human but there is no application is available so what i will do i, I am going to install case and knowledge man management uh, plugin which is containing these uh, four five six seven eight applications or a different uh, uh, i mean uh, there are different applications okay so i am clicking here to load demo data that means it will load the dummy data to understand the uh, uh, life cycle of the hr management this is for the personal development instance if you go to the production instance i, I mean for any organization production instance no need to install any load demo data right so you can uncheck that and that time that is not available okay so here you just i am just click here because uh, now ongoing i will show you how uh, hrsd is work and we will take a proper series on the hrsd okay so let's uh, install so i am installing this so it is going to install guys it is taking time because there are seven eight applications so as you can see case and knowledge management is installing in a in my personal development instance so it is showing a zero percent yet one when it will complete the hundred percent it will install all the uh, applications in my personal development instance okay so uh, currently it is uh, uh, loading you can see the status it is running child progress updating schema creating table index a lot of uh, the installation activity it is running it is taking time guys so this is the basic procedure how we can install the plugin okay and this is the basic thing uh, we are covering currently uh, we can we can also have an option to continue in background if we click on this uh, a button then it will go i mean it will uh, installing that plugin in background okay so this is the uh, uh, this is the process how we can uh, implement uh, i mean how can we install the plugin in our personal development ins instance so once these applications once these uh, plugins has been installed uh, the all application related to the human resource will be listed in the left side of the navigator here and once you will uh, go to the left side navigator and search like HR or something like this all things will be visible to you but currently there is no because we didn't install the yet it is taking time because guys there is a 8-9 things so let me continue in a background <coughs> let me continue it a background uh, so it will uh, take time guys but this is the process uh, to install the plugin in a uh, service node instance now let me show you uh, uh, if we are waiting for this it, it is taking time so no need to wait we will uh, complete this video and uh, before ending the video i will show you one another thing there is a two ui actions i discussed uh, at the beginning that is the find in store and the request plugin if you click on the find in store that will redirect to you on the service now store similar like a google play store okay in this service now play store only those applications applications are listed here uh, which was verified by service now itself and some uh, verified partner of the service now has uh, implemented those application to smooth the business if we want to uh, take any applications from uh, the service now store we need to reach out to them and we can install that plugin or we can use as per our business requirement and they also customize that application there are some applications which are uh, the free of cost but few are the payable applications similar like uh, this is similar for the remembering thing you just uh, keep in mind that this store is similar as a google play store okay so all of things like my subscription offered all filters are available here and uh, see all of these applications like best practice engine if you want to see like uh, in the application if you click on the application it will show you only those applications which are as a listing type as application okay so you can see this is these are the few applications unify integration freelancy instance watch in extension of the instance scan so lot of the things now i will show you suppose that um, i will show you the hrsd application if we are see 
if uh, we, we need to see any application related to the uh, case and knowledge management so these are the few applications which was uh, built up okay so the hr taxonomy uh, i mean uh, map hr catalog and the knowledge content to the hr topics in the employee center so these are the few applications okay and let me show you uh, one thing uh, um, employee central employee rating app see the, uh, someone is implemented let's see who has implemented this employee rating app uh, this employee rating app uh, uh, was uh, you know is free of cost it's a transparent evaluation and to end performance monitoring this will be helpful while uh, uh, he, uh, manager is giving the rating to the employee for the performance perspective so this is uh, uh, will be helpful and the compatibility cap uh, compatibility on the room and the quick version okay you can see the contact seller who is the owner which is the version all of things all information are visible what are the feature effective performance monitoring set goal so all of things this is just for your reference purpose only two custom tables are counted here okay so uh, this is just example how can we use that uh, uh, how can we use that store and if you want to install any plugin uh, you want to request any specific plugin uh, which was not listed in the plugins and the service now store then you just need to uh, click in the request plugin and it will redirect you uh, to the service now instance you need to log in and you can request as a uh, i mean it will uh, if you are high um, organization instance then it will redirect you to the high portal to request a plugin okay so uh, it is similar uh, it will ask me to log in okay so but uh, i i will not uh, go to login because i am already logged in my development instance just for your reference i am sharing that so these uh, these are the two actions and uh, in the background we are installing this okay so this is uh, if you want to see the background installation then you can installation is progress you if you want to see you can click here you can see how many uh, it was done how many percent is uh, it is loading guys yeah see 15 percent is already done so uh, it is guys it is taking time so uh, we will meet in next videos with the case and knowledge management uh, plugins uh, and we will discuss the hr management from beginning if you have any question you want a specific video on a specific topic please comment uh, on the video we will try to capture those scenarios for you uh, our trigoma academy agenda is uh, only to share the knowledge uh, with you okay whatever we have in term of knowledge we are trying our best to share all of things with you okay and uh, uh, please support us guys please like uh, like and comment on video and please subscribe our channel hit the bell icon and so that your uh, your your support and help in this in the subscription definitely encourage us to uh, to make a more videos for you to share the more knowledge with you Thank you guys. Uh, thank you so much for watching the uh, video. If you have uh, any concern, any 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 questions, any query related to this, please reach out to us and please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Please subscribe our channel and share with your colleagues. Thank you so much guys.